hello everyone welcome back to my channel how are you guys doing today i hope you guys are keeping well and you are keeping safe so guys in today's video as you can see what i'm doing now if you want to see how i prepare this delicious chicken coconut fried rice please don't click out keep watching while i introduce the ingredients that I use in preparing this delicious. You'll be living your good life. Catch a glimpse from the outside, then you see me now, see me now, see now. Welcome back, guys. So here are my ingredients. So I have green, yellow, and orange bell pepper. I have black and white bell, a white pepper. I have curry, parsley leaf, thyme, and seasoning cube. And I also have onion and all scotch bonnet. And here is my chopped chicken and also a mixed veg with prom. So these are all the ingredients that I'm going to be needing in preparing my delicious chicken fried rice. So right now, I'm about to heat up my coconut oil. In today's recipe, guys, I am not going to be using any sunflower or vegetable oil. I'm going to be using the coconut oil. So right now, I'm just putting the coconut oil into this hot Hot and allow the oil the coconut oil to melt so after the coconut oil melts I'm going to pour in my chicken so guys stay tuned so guys the coconut oil is hot now is melted so I just pour in the chopped chicken so i'm going to keep stirring it i'm going to keep stirring it to avoid it burning like i don't want it to burn so after a while i'm going to pour in the ingredients that i showed you guys earlier on so yeah so these are all the ingredients so i'm just going to stir it very very well so that the ingredient can soak into the chopped chicken i'm still going to keep stirring it until i'm well sure that the ingredient that i poured in has circulated around the chicken so guys i'm still stirring it i keep stirring it i didn't give it a break i just keep stirring it because i want the ingredient to soak inside the chicken very 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 well so right now that i'm done in uh, stirring it i'm just going to pour in my rice this rice guys i've already washed the rice really really clean i've not parboiled it i've washed it so i'm just putting it inside i'm going to fry the chicken and the rice together guys this i think for me i think this is the best way to make your coconut fried rice or any like any other fried rice that you want to make this is the best way so i'm just turning it to avoid it burning so i'm just stirring it and make sure that i fry it properly like it's properly fried and all the seasoning should soak inside the rice and the chicken so that is what i'm doing here basically right now i'm going to pour in my chicken stock water this water i got it from the chicken that i boil before preparing this rice so i'm just pouring in the water then i stay so i'm just stirring it to make sure that there's no uh burnt rice or burnt chicken and as i'm doing this guys i'm doing this on a very low heat so and then after that i'm going to add water to it and guys if you're preparing something like this sure the water is the same level as the rice so i'm just going to add in more water to it and then i stir it very well so that everything all the ingredient can sit into it the rain i want to be someone who says there's more than meets the eye
now that i'm done stirring i'm going to cover it to heat up for like five minutes and right now i'm going to fry my chicken so i'm going to be using the same coconut oil that i use in frying the rice and the chicken so that is what i'm doing right now i'm just putting in the coconut oil and then i will allow the coconut oil to melt before i start frying the chicken So guys the coconut oil is melted now and i'm just putting in my boiled chicken guys this chicken guys is not african chicken it's not the strong one it is a soft irish chicken so i'm just putting it on into the melted uh, coconuts as you can see and also the reason why i'm covering it it's because of the oil i don't want the oil to uh, split out like it's just jumping out and splashing everywhere so i'm just trying to avoid it splashing on me or my kids because they were a bit closer to me so that's why i covered it so that the oil will not splash everywhere so that's the reason so right now my rice is almost ready you can see that there's no much there's still water on it but there's no much water so i'm just going to stir it i'm going to turn it and then i'll check if it's cooked properly if it's not cooked then i'm going to add a bit of water into it and when i had the water into it i'm not going to stir it anymore i will just cover it up straight away so right now the reason for putting this patches paper is it patchy paper or baking paper is because of the heat guys remember that i'm cooking this rice on a low heat so i do not want a soggy rice that's why i'm putting this baking paper on it so that it will absorb the water that's supposed to go into the rice i don't know if you guys understand me so right now i'm trying to check the chicken to see if that other part is fried just to flip it over to the other part and allow it to fry so guys you see the reason why i use this baking paper to cover the rice this water you guys saw now is was supposed to be the water that we go into the rice straight away if i did not use this idea so in order for you to have a very very good rice like for the rice not to be sticky or moldy i think this is the best way to take away all the excess water and you can see how my rice look right now so i've had a bit of water to eat and then i'm covering it back again with that same baking paper so and i will allow it to cook so right now i'm trying to check the chicken and see if the chicken is properly fried i don't want the chicken too crunchy i just want it a bit brown i love brown chicken guys but i do not want this particular one to be too crunchy i want to feel the softness and a little bit of crunchiness on it so i'm going to still leave it for a while to allow it to fry a little bit for like a five minutes more before i'll start taking them out walking the lines fine but i hope one day you'll break so guys my chicken is ready yes it's a bit crunchy and soft this is how i want it it's so sweet it's so yummy guys so guys this coconut oil i'm not going to go let it go to waste i'm going to use it to fry all my veggies so right now i'm pouring in my chopped onion and i'm going to pour in my yellow orange and green bell pepper and then i will stir it a bit 
and add my mist veg into it and after that i'm going to pour in my prawn and add a bit of salt and a little bit of seasoning cube for taste so guys i will really recommend this recipe for you guys don't use sunflower or cook or vegetable cooking oil just use coconut oil is very very good guys at this point my whole family were just walking around walking around they are waiting for this deliciousness to ready for them to eat like everywhere was so good was smelly so good guys try out this my recipe and come and thank me later yes guys <laughs> so after doing this guys i'm going to pour it into my rice and then i will mix everything together so i think i need to stop here and allow you to enjoy the rest process if this is your first time of coming across my amazing channel please do consider subscribing and also don't forget to turn on your post notification and you are highly welcome to this amazing channel and my name is patient known as Iyawo Ola I'm a mom of three based in Ireland and I do family vlog I do lifestyle I do wonderful stuff on this channel and if you find this channel interesting enough why not considering sus subscribing to this channel subscribe and join the family and you will not regret subscribing at all and to my old fam my old returning subscribers i call them my family because they are my family now i really appreciate all your love and your support may god bless you all for me amen okay guys i think i need to stop here like i said before and allow you guys to enjoy the deliciousness of this wonderful chicken coconut fried rice i will talk to you guys in my next video until then remain blessed i love you all bye the things that you're feeling capture your body get your best side breathe in the world fake us a smile walk in the lines fine but i hope one day you'll break the It's progress you're making Copy and paste pretty faces All the time Pictures so perfect we play through Only cause you set up the angle Web that you weave got us tangled Caught in what's before our eyes Show off your fantasy reality Whoa Perfection, what is it we chase? Bow for your 15 seconds of fame. It's your time. Give me the messy, give me the pain. A rose will not grow without the rain. 
I wanna be someone who says There's more than meets the eye